let's jump through the wormhole and check out some of the weirdest discoveries made throughout the cosmos. Supersonic shocks traveling through the cosmos. Have you ever seen a jet go supersonic and create a shockwave in the air? Shockwaves can cause some serious damage, and astronomers have recently detected shockwaves traveling faster than the speed of sound through plasma waves, as well as the electric and magnetic fields permeating all of space. These supersonic shocks can be created from a number of events, such as massive supernovas or ejections from black holes, and can cause massive damage if an object gets in their way. The shocks that are generated can travel incredibly distances and can have much more far-reaching effects than the events themselves. Will we be able to know if one is making its way towards us? Fast-moving planet killers Lurking out in nearly every corner of the cosmos, there seems to be something powerful enough to destroy our entire world. These objects include gargantuan asteroids that, for the most part, are extremely hard to detect. But that didn't stop astronomers from looking and locating several of these massive space rocks within our own solar system. In fact, some of these planet killers have been found in the inner solar system, silently orbiting in close proximity to the Earth since they were captured in the formation of the solar system. Earth's Black Hole Neighbor Astronomers have detected a certain gravitational monster that could lead to the end of our world hiding in our own neighborhood. At a distance over three times closer than the Milky Way's central black hole, astronomers have detected the nearest black hole ever found to Earth. Sitting at just 1,500 light years from us, this is by far the closest black hole that scientists have been able to find. This particular black hole may have evaded detection for so long because of how lightweight it is, coming in at just around three solar masses. Finding a black hole of this size is no small task either. The rarity of the find, along with its location within the constellation Monoceros, prompted its discoverers to choose its name, the Unicorn an electric current that is super massive. Astronomers have just found an interesting electrical anomaly sitting around 2 billion light years from our solar system. Like many others, within the galaxy known as 3C303 lives a supermassive black hole. But unlike others, this one is producing an electric current with an insane strength. Measuring in at 1,018 amps, this current is the strongest current ever seen. Stretching out for 150,000 light years, larger than the diameter of the Milky Way, this electrical current is as strong as a trillion bolts of lightning. If scientists can unlock this process of seemingly endless renewable electricity, could it reveal hints that could help our own journey towards that for Earth? Stars moving at blinding speeds Sitting 5,000 light years from the center of the Milky Way, our solar system is in a pretty calm area, but that's not the case for everywhere. As you move closer to the supermassive black hole at the center of our galaxy, the gravitational forces present get exponentially stronger. This increase in force means that the stars nearest to Sagittarius A star are moving at breakneck speeds. Over 1,000 of these stars have been found to date, and they can reach speeds of between 30 and 100,000 kilometers per second. That's 18,000 to 62,000 miles per second. At these speeds, hypervelocity is the needed velocity to escape their orbit and begin a journey out of the galaxy. How many stars has our galaxy lost over its lifetime? Will the JWST find strange matter? Look around you. Everything you can see is made up of matter, which is composed of atoms with nuclei in their centers. These nuclei are themselves composed of fundamental particles called quarks bound together by gluons, the carriers of the strong force. But astronomers believe that in special places in the universe, another kind of matter might be hidden. Strange matter. This theoretical substance is missing a key part of ordinary matter, the gluons holding their protons and neutrons together. 
In Strange Matter, the nucleus is composed of free-moving quarks, giving it some unique properties. For one, if Strange Matter were to come into contact with ordinary atoms, models say it would transfer its properties, starting a chain reaction that would eventually lead to the entire universe becoming Strange Matter. No one really knows what would happen in this case, but with the power of the James Webb Space Telescope, astronomers will be looking in the deep corners of the cosmos to see what is hiding there. Raining Glass on HD 189773B Exoplanet hunting has been all the rage for a number of years now. This has led to the number of exoplanets we know of exploding in number to over 5,000. No doubt among these are some peculiar planets. Take, for example, HD 189773B. Known as a hot Jupiter, it appears as a blue marble floating through space. But this calm appearance is misleading. The planet's 1300 degrees Celsius temperatures, along with its silicate-rich atmosphere, leads to glass forming in the high clouds before falling down and pelting the surface with shards of glass traveling significantly faster than the speed of sound. Real Life Tatooine the James Webb Space Telescope has joined the hunt for exoplanets and has just found a bizarre one that appears to be completely shrouded in massive clouds of swirling sand. This special planet sits 72 light years from Earth in the constellation of Crovis and is extra special as it's orbiting two small red dwarf stars. With a double sunrise and sunset along with clouds of sand constantly blowing, you may notice a resemblance to an important planet from a galaxy far, far away. But unfortunately, the atmosphere of the planet known as VHS-1256b is composed of a very skewed ratio of methane and carbon, and with a 70,000-year orbit, a single year on this exoplanet would seem to never end. A bizarre red quasar spotted by JWST the James Webb Space Telescope has been on the hunt for new discoveries since its launch in 2022, and it's detected new exoplanets, galaxies, and anomalies at a rate never before experienced. Just a few months after its launch, it made a surprising discovery – a bright red quasar. Red quasars are a special type of active galactic nucleus housing a supermassive black hole that has massive amounts of dust and gas flowing into it. Thanks to JWST's infrared capabilities, it was able to examine this quasar that has been active for 11 and a half billion years and found three galaxies orbiting each other at high speeds in a galactic merger. These galaxies, along with two theoretical halos of dark matter, make this is the densest area of the known universe and may help astronomers unlock some of the mysteries of galactic evolution. The early universe was different. The universe is old, nearly 13.8 billion years old. What the cosmos was like all that time ago has been a mystery for a long time. Hubble was able to look back in time to get a glimpse of what it may have been like. But now that the James Webb is up and running, astronomers have been able to look back even further. And what they've found there is forcing them to rethink parts of their story of the universe. It turns out that galaxies may have formed much earlier than originally thought, around just 300 million years after the Big Bang. This level of maturity, along with the diversity found, surprised scientists and is leading them to analyze their current models and adjust them to fit what Webb is showing them. If you enjoyed this video, check out one of our other videos, like the 7 creepy things you didn't know about CERN.